Hello, my name is Elizabeth Gaines and I'm the former CEO of Fortescue and I'm delighted to now be the Global Green Ambassador for the company. In the 20 years since Fortescue began, we have risen to become the fourth largest iron ore producer in the world. Our 180 million tonnes of iron ore a year now underpin the world's steel economy. There's a catch though. Emissions from our mines are the size of a small country's. Factor in the carbon from the ships that export our iron ore and from our customers, and we emit as much as the entire country of France. The world doesn't just need iron ore and steel anymore, it needs green iron ore and green steel. And that's why we're changing to become a global green energy and resources company. Hi, I'm Scarlett, I'm six years old. This truck behind me is so huge, it makes me look tiny. But taking on something bigger than you doesn't mean you have to be stronger, just smarter. We all have the power to take on the biggest enemy of this planet, climate change. And the power we need comes from smart people like my mum, who works here at Fortescue to turn the big polluting monsters into the big green machines of the future. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Thomas, and I'm an engineer based in the e-powertrain and integration team at Williams Advanced Engineering in Oxford. Most people know about the work we do with pioneering electric racing series, such as Formula E and Extreme, which we believe showcase the race cars of the future, powered by green, clean energy. My role in the company is to work with Fortescue Future Industries, Fortescue's green energy and technology company, to support the advancement of innovative new battery power solutions that are required to decarbonise their mining operations to achieve net zero carbon emissions. Working in partnership with Lieber, our priority is to produce zero carbon battery and hydrogen powered mining coal trucks for Fortescue by 2030. We are also currently developing the world's first infinity train, a regenerating iron ore train that will use gravitational energy to recharge its battery electric systems during its downhill journey from the mine site to the port in Western Australia. Here at Williams Advanced Engineering, in partnership with Fortescue, we're excited to be part of a race to a green future. Today, we announce a new aim for Fortescue. By 2030, we want our diesel trucks, iron ore processing facilities, trains and port to run on renewable electricity and green hydrogen. Why? Because the cost of diesel and natural gas is going up, whereas the cost of renewables is coming down. It's the right thing to do for the climate, and it's the right thing to do for our business and our shareholders. With her team, my mum isn't waiting until it's too late for me and the planet. They're making it happen using a power we all have. The power of now!